Well, I'm afraid the current situation is critical. Firstly, there are countries or their regions in the EU Southeast neighborhood where governing structures or their elements collapsed or were weakened. Somewhere the power vacuum has been filled by Daesh and other fanatics spreading hate and terror. This poses an ongoing challenge for UN, EU external policy and our allies. Secondly, in some European districts the situation was overlooked and developed in a way that some people can be easy target for radicalization. And the attacks were committed also by homegrown terrorists. To cope with this environment and change it, it represents a gigantic challenge for member states and their municipal authorities. The new unprecedented level of terrorist threat requires also new approaches to cope with it. Sharing information between member states, at least, must become a reality at last. It's also our role to work further on it, as well as on other elements of our common approach. No country can make it on its own. The EU with its allies can together.